J-Man here. Uh, I am doing quite well. I got my new Pac-Man cup. Revitalized. I had this thing in the uh, in the cupboard for years. I had it in the cupboard for years. I think the reason why <clears throat> I think the reason why I put it up there was I was afraid it was going to break one day. And so I just stopped using it because I didn't want it to... It was my favorite cup. That kind of sounds like a pretty gay reason to stop using your cup, huh? But there's other ones on eBay, so I'm okay. And they're not that expensive, and there's a bunch of them, so I have nothing to worry about. J-Man has nothing to worry about. So it feels good to bring this cup out of hiding. I've reclaimed a bunch of things in my life and it feels amazing. Like like my glass, can you hear can you see that well? Like my glass deer head from 2011. For years I was for years that deer head reminded me of Everything I went through, all the money I blew in 2011, I blew like $15,000 in like a three month period. I wasn't too happy about it. So like every time that I would see that deer head, it would just remind me of this, pe this period that I spun out. But the truth is, is after this 2021 wait awakening, that deer head symbolizes strength. Because what happened back then was, you know what kicked it all off? It was the first time I went to see a counselor. My girlfriend left me. No, that sounded, that sounded funny. She actually left to go out of the country. We were on like amicable terms. Don't don't worry. Nobody's leaving the J man. Nobody's gonna leave the J man. And you're like, no way. Somebody left the J man. But she left. I can't remember where she went. I I I I I wasn't listening when she said something. Uh I, I don't know what she said, but she left the country and I went to go see a counselor <clears throat> and it was the first time I realized that I had all of this trauma that was completely, it was basically unconscious trauma that was completely running the show. And I was just, I was just a reactionary passenger in the seat of the trauma. Man, that's that's a good way to look at it. That's wow, that's that's brilliant actually. I was just a passenger. I was just sit, I was sitting in the car. I was just riding it out. Man, that's an excellent that's an excellent way to look at it. I'm going to have to write that down. Damn. I really am sharper without smoking. Yesterday was a good day partially because I made a strong attempt to just get away from smoking. And like I can do I can do this obviously without smoking. I can handle it. Um Yeah. Yeah. So back to the therapy. It was the first time I really started to crack open that all of those trauma feelings from back in the day. And once I did that, once I realized like a lot of this anxiety that I had was from that trauma that I never dealt with. And once I, once I did that, I wanted to live so bad 
you know, I wasn't sleeping. I was, I was so, I was so amped up, you know, I was, I was realizing that my car accident, I was realizing that God saved me in my car accident. I, I believed so much in God. I was so passionate. I wasn't eating. I wasn't eating very well. I wasn't sleeping very well. I, I wasn't taking my thyroid medication very well which that can mess up your memory and your mind you just get all your mind gets foggy and then on top of that I was smoking a lot uh, I think I was I think I was celibate back then too yeah I think I was celibate back then too but anyway that deer head is a symbol of strength now for me it's an absolute strength it's like me reclaiming a part of myself that I basically abandoned and amputated it off of my body. And now I'm just saying, no, no, I want it back. Like, give it to me back because it's awesome. And every time I look at that, like the other day, I went into my kitchen and I was getting my, I was getting my coffee and I looked at it from the side and it's just, it's so thick and massive, like my face. No, but it's so thick and massive from the side. And the way that the way that the light hits off of it with like the red the red flare. Like from from the side, it just looks it looks so awesome. It's it's like it's crazy. Alright. Good talk.